Welcome to our series In Love With Love. It's a beautiful world out there. Just don't pass on the dare. If you have the will and a moment to spare, it's a beautiful world out there. It's a beautiful world out there. Hi guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. So today we are here in Lao. We've been here already four days. It's been amazing beautiful people are so nice very friendly uh, so we first start in this island Sipandon islands in southern laos um, they are called the four thousand islands and today we are in don sum is i will say one of the most beautiful ones there is only one guest house where we stay and the rest is just uh, local culture We came here from Cambodia and we took a minivan from Siem Rep to the border in North Cambodia and as always we were very lucky that we were the only two on the two people on the van. Yeah, we read online before going that this is one of the more difficult land borders to cross but honestly we've had the smoothest experience. We got dropped after Cambodia exit border to get the exit stamp, then walk two, three hundred meters to the Lao border, sit there, fill in the visa form, pay the fee for the visa, waited about 15, 20 minutes, and then we paid the extra $2 administration fee, and the bus was waiting for us. So as soon as we finished, they took us to Nagasong, which is the nearest town where we took the boat to Dundet. And the boat was also waiting for us and took about 20, 10 minutes. So the entire journey from CM Rep was so smooth and super easy. So we start in Dondet. It is the most popular island for the tourists. Uh, it's a town with restaurants, bars, shops, tourist information. You can also exchange money, but there is no ATM. If you wanna exchange money, make sure you check for the prices around. Some prices might be lower or higher. Uh, we recommend you to change money in an Adams bar. That's where they were offering the highest amount of uh, exchange rate. You can also buy the SIM cards in Dundet, which is cheaper than in the border. And you will not need much internet from the border to Dundet, the distance is very short. We stay at the town, you can find very cheap accommodation there from $2 for a dorm to $5 for private rooms without AC and $10 with AC. So the must do activity in Dondet is to rent bicycles. It costs only about $1 per bike per day and you can ride around the entire Dondet island and also Don Con in the south. So. When you rent it, I recommend going down the coast, on the east coast of Don Det, and ride towards the south island, which is Don Con. And in Don Con, you can go and see the waterfalls. It's very, very beautiful place, and it costs only about $2 to enter. Of course, you can stop anywhere on the way as well, if you want something to drink or eat, and explore the Don Con island before you were returning north to Don Det. So we highly recommend you a place called Wrap and Roll. It's a small island on the east coast of Dundet. Walk across the walking bridge and you arrive at the family-owned restaurant which serves fantastic food. Another one that we went to a couple of times is Adam's Bar. It's very close to the ferry in the town and it's a super chill place with good western food. And they also show live sports. It's actually the only place in town where you can watch live football. So obviously we ended up there. Yeah, we watched Man United against Man City on the final. And the last place we recommend going to is Happy Backpackers Bar. It's also a very chill place. They have amazing food, including the Dundet specialty, the pumpkin burger. And they also have the best sunset views that we saw. Yeah, the pumpkin burger, imagine you eating fried chicken. Oof, that's, that's how it felt when I was eating it. So instead of putting a patty, they put a pumpkin fried on, on the burger. Dong Som is one of the 
less touristic islands. We are probably staying in the only guest house on this island and our room basically has a bed, a mosquito net and a fan. And that's pretty much all we need at the minute. Yeah, life is pretty easy here. Uh, there are no restaurants, so we basically have to eat in the same in, place in the, in the guest house. We just had this amazing omelette for breakfast, a Lao omelette. Oh yeah, comes with rice, vegetables. So Emily did the idea of make a little burger, as you can see here. So we just put the vegetables on top. And guess what? We have the beautiful company of our friend right there, the goat. <laughs> so now we are gonna explore the town. Uh, when I mean the town, it's just like houses next to each other. And, it's this road. And that's basically, it. there's no restaurants, just like few shops, and that's it. It's just this road. So, here we have lots of uh, mosquitoes, snakes, frogs, spiders. It's spiders. It's just like living in the nature, you know? So, we just stopped by to have a, a little Pepsi, and we stopped by this nice, beautiful home. Uh, was this nice lady with her probably five, six kids and she was super happy just to sell us this. <laughs> it's gonna rain! Finally! <laughs> Finally! It can start raining any second in this part of Laos. So now the locals said that we just start the rainy season, just the beginning, so we get some little showers in between the month. We said it can start raining at any second. Here yeah, we are. Here we are. Walking in the rain. Yeah, it was very hot in one moment. Yeah, I'm very humid. I knew the rain was coming. Oh, we don't mind rain. Yeah, we don't. After living eight years in Dubai, yeah. we love rain. We love rain. So that's all from Si Pandon, the 4000 islands. Now we are going to continue going north with the next stop being Pakse, which is known for having beautiful waterfalls. If you want to continue following our journey around the world, and this series, beautiful series called In Love with Laos, as we go from south to north Laos, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Uh, that will keep you up to date and also helps us a lot. We don't need the past in our lives for tomorrow Never see the end of the night for sorrow What do we do to love? What do we do to love?